to the Amwas of the 114th AGH Goulburn. The years quickly passing away have brought us all to this holiday. It's 45 years since we first met together and ever since then, whatever the weather, we've had our reunions, our Goulburn weekends, our Remembrance Day service to honour our friends. Our children, reluctantly, listen a while, then to each other they silently smile. What were bivouacs, Dixies, a six mile route march, mess calls and khakis and cold water starch? Huddled over the fire, telling each other tales, sewing little red crosses upon our white veils. The Padre, who faithfully called us to prayer, the M.O., who father like, took greatest care of our backache, our acne, our blisters and woes, and even the tinea that itched between toes. The passing of time can never erase the genuine friendship I see in each face. Though many have left us, and our turn is next, we look back with pride, for we pass the test of obeying orders to work as a team, to scrub out the day room and keep our rooms clean. To comfort the boys so young and confused with skills quickly learned but professionally used. Their sores we would bathe, their beards we would shave, and after shock treatments we'd help them behave like gentlemen, remembering the good things of life, to blot out the experience of overseas strife. The future ahead for the next generation has already begun with great celebration. We pray our grandchildren will help to discover this country where peace and concern for each other is everyone's goal. So this land of the free will be great and do justice to our history.